All right, uh, got another practice done this morning. Uh, saw some things that we thought, you know, might be able to, uh, that we might be able to develop into something that can help us uh, win some games. Uh, still got a lot of work to do, though. And uh, anytime you uh, have a morning like this morning where we, you know, we, we started early with special teams meeting, we did some uh, special kind of special team stuff, and then we come back from there and did, did a lot of uh, a lot of situational kind of things within our, our team and, and, and the inside periods. It was uh, rather interesting. With one scrimmage down and going into your second one, have you addressed some of the issues you had from your first scrimmage? Well, yeah, you do, but now part of the deal is at this point you you be starting to get banged up a little bit. So sometimes when you're addressing issues with a guy who got hurt last scrimmage, and you got to deal with those issues again with the next group. So. You know, it is what it is. It's the spring. Uh, uh, we are still trying to, more than anything else, you know, develop a little bit of uh, uh, high-level kind of efficiency. But at the same time, uh, it is the spring. You don't quite have the same kind of um, uh, effect as you do during the regular season. You're stressing to the young guys, find your niche, find your spot. How important is that? Well, uh, if you want to play, <laughs> you better find some place that you can play. Uh, you, you, guys, you have guys on a football team sometimes, they just kind of, you know, hide not back in the back of the room somewhere. They're not really doing anything. And, you know, we're trying to encourage those guys that this is the time of year that if you're going to be a part of this team, actually be a, uh, a contributing part of this team, then you're going to have to go, ahead, go out and show us you can do something. Any, any of the young guys uh, stand out to you? Well, you, got, you, you get some guys, you know, some of our you know, young offensive line guys, the Robert Stevensons of the world. You know, hopefully we get something out of a guy like a Jake Scott here for a change because, you know, he's been in our program for a couple of years and we're trying to find some things that they can do. You know, Dustin Brothers asked today if he could be on field goal and PAT, you know, so we stuck him in there to look at him a little bit. But, you know, more than anything else right now, you're just still trying to work around to see who can do what. And, you know, I think we still got a lot of guys that there's still some question marks on.